Welcome back guys. So today we're going to be reviewing the new Magic Box 2.0 and the new Elite Car Box from Stream to Your Car. There's one twist. I was tricked by the Magic Box team because when this was announced and released, I went straight to their website and I looked at their specs. It was telling me about the 4 gigabyte RAM and the 64 gigabyte storage, but it was not telling me which version of Android it is on. But I knew that their previous generation was on Android 11. So I just ordered it. And when I got it, I connected it and I went straight to the settings and where the Android version is supposed to be, it's telling me Magic Box OS. So I scrolled down a little bit more and it's telling me Android Q. I don't know what Android Q is. Pull out your phone, go on your, your computer, your laptop, look up what Android Q is. And it's gonna tell you the same thing it told me. It is Android 10. Now, if I got an, an iPhone 14, why would I put a software from an iPhone 11? Why am I going backwards? I don't, under, I don't understand that part. Most customers don't know what Android Q is. And if they find out what Q stands for, they would be, they would be hurt that they are downgrading and not improving and moving forward. So this leads me to Elite Car Box from Stream to Your Car. Now this was released last week. You already know what I did, okay? So I ran straight to the website and then guess what? Their specs are all there. Nothing's hiding. They tell me the version. I have Android 12 on this, okay? So let me tell you something real quick. These guys, the Magic Box 2.0, you get four gigabytes, okay? That's cute, that's cute. You get eight gigabytes over here. Now you get 64 gigabytes over here of storage, okay? That's cute. 128 gigabytes of storage on this one. And guess what? I'm on version 12 of Android. Now we're gonna test this out on my Ford Bronco. Let's go test them out, baby. And you're gonna be connecting your Magic Box 2.0, okay? So you get this USB, you connect it into this. The other end goes down here. As you guys can see already, this is the Magic Box 2.0. This is the brand new Ford Bronco with a 12 inch screen and from the start, you could already tell that I don't have access to this, but let's agree and accept, okay? Now, as you guys could see, my right side of the screen is not really working. It looks like that the apps are just cut off. So now I'm gonna show you guys the version Android, okay? So this is where you guys are gonna find the Android Q that I was telling you about earlier. So you're gonna go to about device. This is where it would say which Android version it is, but it says Magic Box OS. Now, this is where it says Android Q. Now, I want you guys to pull out your phone and go on Google and look up what Android Q is if you guys don't believe what I'm saying. Also, once again, there's a black screen. I would love to use my full screen, but it doesn't let me now. I'm going to show you guys another settings that I downloaded from the Google Play Store on this actual device and it kind of breaks down exactly what I've been telling you guys. Um, it's going to confirm that it is Android 10 and I'm going to show you guys that right now. So I'm going to go to the settings and then I'm going to go down to, 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 to system. Oh no, wait, no, sorry. I am going to go down to about tablet, right? Now we're going to scroll down and as of right there, you guys see that? It says Android version 10, okay? I just found something out on the Magic Box 2.0 by using Google Assistant, and it kind of threw me off. So I'm gonna show you guys what happens when you click this. So I don't know what this all is, but I, I don't like ads. I don't know why they're throwing ads when I'm trying to talk to the assistant. Now, what's going on? I was denied, don't ask again, let's see. What's, what's going on? I thought this was Google Assistant, not Google Ads. So I don't know what's up with all this Chinese writing. I don't know what Chinese, um, you know, ads that they're throwing into this, but this is not Google Assist and it's not something I would like to use at all. So now I'm gonna be showing you guys what YouTube looks like on this screen. We have connected to the uh, mobile hotspot. I have uh, kids, so that's why Coco Melon pops up, but this is what it looks like. I do not like this. And as you guys can still see that this black box is still there, I don't have access 
to it. Now, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be switching over to the Elite Car Box, and I'm going to be showing you what Android 12 looks like on there and comparing YouTube. So we're going to be unplugging the Magic Box 2.0, and we're going to be connecting the Elite Car Box so you guys can see what it looks like on my Bronco. Now we wait for the boot process, and I'm going to speed this part up. as well. So I just plugged up the Elite Car Box down here into the USB, and this is what it looks like booted up onto my Ford Bronco with the 12-inch screen. And as you guys could see this, it takes up the whole screen. And my right side works. Look at that. I could play with my map. And I'm going to show you guys what Google Assist looks like on this one, okay? Google, open up YouTube. Look at that. No YouTube. ads. YouTube. Nothing. No, no Chinese writing. It goes straight to YouTube. That is crazy. And this is what it looks like on my screen. It's the full 12 inch screen, but I'm gonna play a video. As you guys can see, this is just a normal ad from YouTube. We're gonna skip this. You could actually exit that out. Wait, hold on. Boom, look at that. You guys have the full screen to watch your YouTube videos, to watch whatever you guys want you, as you guys can see this is what elite car box provides they took a little bit longer to release this but as you guys can see it works flawlessly and you can't go wrong with this look how youtube is looking on here look how we could just on a touch it just goes to what you want it it just reacts to your your touch every single time as you guys see here google open up youtube opening YouTube you, you see how quick it does it it just opens it now look how the video plays I can't go wrong with this I'm gonna I'm show you guys one more thing we're gonna go to all the apps I have access to all of my apps and I love that and it just shows you guys the time and effort that elite car box took to release and perfect this product compared to the Magic Box 2.0. For me, I already know what product I'm gonna go with. Now you guys decide if you guys wanna go backward in time, or you guys can move forward with the Elite Car Box from stream to your car with Android 12, okay? They don't they don't hide it. The, all their specs are on the box and all over the website. So you guys already know what product I'm going with. I'm going to be going with Elite Car Box from Stream to Your Car. See you guys in the next video.